YouTube, Bad Disturb back with another video for you guys. And today we're going to be tinting the tail lights on the SRT4 uh, because a lot of people have been saying that they're ricer tail lights, but I thought I would make them look a little bit nicer because that way when I pass a Mustang or a Camaro or whatever the hell it is, they'll have a nice view to see whenever they see them because more than likely they will see them. But, uh, anyway, guys, uh, let's get straight into the video. Um, we're going to be using window tint to tint the uh, tail lights. So, uh, we're going to show you how to do that. Hope you guys like the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And let's get into this video. All right, guys, he's applying the window tint to the tail light. And he's getting all the air bubbles and stuff out. He's trying to get all the wrinkles out and stuff because it's a really a pain in the ass to pull the clear layer of film from the actual window tent. Alright guys, so we said fuck the window tent because it was wrinkling and stuff, so we got the um, tail light in the oven. We're going to take apart the tail light and we're going to do it that way. We're going to, and he's going to do hand puppets and stuff. <laughs> but uh, anyway guys, we'll, we'll, we're, well, how many minutes we got before we take it out? A minute and 46 seconds. A yeah, minute and 46 seconds. Welcome to Master Chef Car Edition. Yeah. You know your car people when you have a flathead screwdriver on your stove. Yeah. And you don't think it's time to do the stove? You can't tell my wife. <laughs> <laughs> no, she'd be pretty upset. <laughs> but I'll get to you whenever we uh, take this out. And that's how you bake a pie. Plastic wrinkled. Damn it. You're like bad wrinkled. Look at We were trying to get the wrinkle out and uh, I guess we pressed too hard or something and we cracked it. So new plans guys, we're going to go 3D mode. He's in the mix of taking the depot uh, tail light apart. And uh, I mean we have nothing in these tail lights whatsoever. They was given to me and they came on his old SRT so. It's not nothing, it's nothing that's going to amount to anything anyway. I got stock tail lights if I have to put, use them for the time being. Oh, the plan C. Yeah, plan C. But uh, that's the update so far. He's just taken out the, the um, LEDs. There's a screw on the back that you remove them. And uh, we're getting all the epoxy from around the, the tail light. We're cleaning all that up. And uh, that's pretty much it, guys. I'll check back in with you when we get all that done. Hi, right, I'm a brake light. I'm brake checking you. You better stop. Well, guys, we are on plan W's, X, Y, Z, whatever you want to call it. We're going to Walmart for the time being, and uh, we're going to throw the stop tail lights back in it for the time being and tint those. Until we can figure out a way to make those uh, depot taillights work because 
I'm worried about the rain and stuff getting in into the tail light and possibly rusting out the SRT and I'd rather be safe than sorry. Um, instead of doing the 3D look, we decided just to go ahead and throw the stoppings in it. And that way there won't be no rust or nothing like that it's caused by a caused by a tail light because the rust repair is more expensive than replacing your tail lights. So that's what we're doing. We're going to head to Walmart and uh, whenever we get there, I'll uh, start filming again. Well, guys, we got the lens tent. We're going to go check out and then we're going to go back to the house and apply this stuff on. Alright guys, we're back, back at the house and in the garage. And uh, got the stock tail lights here. Uh, they can be found in any neon. These tail lights can be found in any neon from 2003 to 2005. Um, um, we're just cleaning them for the time being until we can figure out what we're going to do with those over there, the depots. So what we're going to do, we're going to and throw them back in the car for the time being. This is a temporary solution for the time being. And uh, as you can tell, we we got some, uh, we went to Walmart and we got this kind of, of uh, stuff here. It's pill coat uh, lens tint. It's a removable a lens tin that you can remove, kind of like um, plastic dip in a way, I guess. But uh, that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be lightening, uh, tinting these. What you want to do is you want to clean the surface of what you're going to be painting, which that's typical with any, anything that you paint. Um, make sure you clean, and your prep job will. It all depends on how well you prep. It turns out how good your job will turn out. So we're just going to lightly tint these and throw them back in the car. So he's going to go ahead and lightly tint these. Never use this stuff. But find out. I've always actually used regular window tent. Yeah. But that cheap tent wasn't. Yeah, this tent's all wrinkly and shit. It was aggravating and. It, it's very cheap tent, so it is, didn't want to do what it's supposed to do. Well, we added a couple more coats, and uh, here, here's one without anything on it, and here's some um, with coats on it. Um, write down in the comments if you think we should go darker than this. There's the original, and then there's ones with, I don't know, maybe four coats on it. But uh, let me know down in the comments, guys, what you think. Okay, guys, I wanted to announce something real quick. Um, we're going to be doing a giveaway, so make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. This, these, uh, this part will work on either a um, Dodge Neon or a or a Dodge uh, SRT4, Dodge Neon SRT4. Um, they are 1.5 uh, drop springs. And uh, if you would be interested in winning those, we're going to be picking a lucky subscriber in the comments below. So make sure you please like, comment, and subscribe. And like the Bad Disturbed Facebook page also. And put down in the comments why you think you should be picked to win these drop springs. The, the value of the drop springs are probably like $200. They come with all four springs. So, um... Just giving back to you guys for supporting us, and hopefully we can make this channel something great. Um, but let's do that right now, guys. Go down in the comment section below, 
tell us why you should win and me and my friend Bri will look over the comments and we'll decide a winner. So good luck to you guys. Make sure you like the like um Badger Facebook page. Link is in the description below. There the link is always in the description below of every video that I do. So good luck to you guys and we'll get back to these tail lights. Alright guys, well there's the end result. This is temporary fix for right now. But uh That's pretty much all I got for you guys today. Guys, please remember to comment below why you should win the uh, subscriber giveaway for the drop springs for your 2000 to 2005 Dodge Neon or Dodge Neon SRT4. Uh, make sure you do that. Make sure you like the Bad Stir Facebook page. Links to everything will be in the comments in the description below. But uh, that's pretty much all I got for you guys today. I appreciate everybody's support. And uh, I'm Bad Disturbed. We'll see you guys in the next video. Mopar or no car. Take care, guys.